Welcome back to our channel, folks. Today, we've got some vital information to share with you about prostate enlargement and how certain foods can potentially exacerbate this condition. If you or someone you know is dealing with the frustrating symptoms like frequent or urgent urination, nighttime bathroom trips, or a weak urine stream, you're in the right place. Prostate enlargement can significantly impact your quality of life, and it's often driven by hormonal imbalances, specifically the buildup of anabolic hormones such as DHT and estrogen. In this eye-opening video, we'll unveil the top 6 worst foods you should steer clear of if you're grappling with prostate enlargement. We'll also provide you with the best alternatives to these foods. These foods have been found to stimulate those troublesome hormones and contribute to the swelling and enlargement of the prostate gland, making urination an everyday challenge. So, if you're ready to take charge of your prostate health and learn how to manage this condition through your diet, stick around. Please remember that the information presented in this video is intended solely for educational purposes and should not be viewed as a replacement for professional medical guidance or advice. Caffeine found in popular beverages like coffee, tea, and even some sodas is a natural stimulant that can affect various systems within our bodies, including the urinary system. One of caffeine's well-known properties is its diuretic effect, meaning it can increase urine production. For individuals with an already enlarged prostate, this can be problematic. The increased urine production can result in more frequent trips to the bathroom, especially during the night. This can lead to disrupted sleep patterns and added discomfort. Caffeine can also irritate the bladder. When the bladder is irritated, it can exacerbate urinary symptoms such as urgency and frequency. For someone with an enlarged prostate, these symptoms are already a concern, and caffeine can make them even more bothersome. Furthermore, caffeine can have an impact on hormone levels in the body. It can lead to a temporary increase in stress hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. These hormonal fluctuations, especially when chronic, can contribute to inflammation and hormonal imbalances, which can play a role in prostate enlargement. If you're dealing with an enlarged prostate, it's worth considering a reduction in caffeine intake or avoiding it altogether. Saw Palmetto is a well-known herbal remedy for prostate health. It's believed to help reduce the symptoms of an enlarged prostate, such as frequent urination. Pygium is another herbal remedy with potential benefits for prostate health. It's derived from the bark of the African plum tree and is known for its anti-inflammatory properties. Next on our list is dairy products. If you're suffering from an enlarged prostate, it's highly advisable to either eliminate or significantly reduce your consumption of dairy products like curd, butter, cream, cheese, and milk derived from cow or goat. Milk contain natural growth hormones like IGF-1 and prolactin. Instead, consider opting for alternatives that are less likely to irritate your already enlarged prostate. When we consume dairy products containing prolactin, this hormone enters our system. For individuals with an enlarged prostate, prolactin can potentially stimulate the prostate gland, leading to further growth. This added stimulation can exacerbate the condition, resulting in increased discomfort and urinary symptoms. IGF-1 plays a pivotal role in promoting cell growth and division. Dairy products, particularly those from cow or goat milk, can contain significant levels of IGF-1. When consumed, excessive IGF-1 can influence the growth of cells within the prostate gland and in individuals already dealing with an enlarged prostate. This can cause further irritation and enlargement of the gland. This, in turn, can lead to a weaker urine stream and more frequent urination. Instead, consider exploring alternatives like almond milk, soy milk, or Greek yogurt, which tend to have lower levels of prolactin and IGF-1. You might be surprised to learn that various vegetable oils, including olive, sunflower, palm, canola, coconut, safflower, corn, peanut, cottonseed, palm kernel, and soybean oils are rich in omega-6 fatty acids. While omega-6 fatty acids are a vital part of a balanced diet, an excessive intake of them can lead to inflammation in our bodies, including the prostate gland and liver. 
Now, you might be wondering, what does the liver have to do with prostate health? Well, the liver plays a crucial role in hormone regulation and balance within our bodies. When we consume an abundance of omega-6 fatty acids from these oils, it can lead to inflammation not only in the prostate gland, but also in the liver. This inflammation can disrupt the liver's ability to effectively regulate hormones. As a result, estrogen and insulin levels may rise in our bodies. Elevated levels of estrogen and insulin have been linked to prostate enlargement. So, when omega-6 fatty acids from vegetable oils cause inflammation and disrupt hormonal balance in the liver, they indirectly contribute to the growth and enlargement of the prostate gland. Not all fats are bad for you. In fact, some fats, like those found in fish, flax seeds, and walnuts, are rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which have anti-inflammatory properties and can be beneficial for prostate health. Olive oil, for instance, is known for its abundance of heart-healthy monounsaturated fats and is a much better choice. Processed meats like fast food, chicken nuggets, beef jerky, pepperoni, breakfast sausage, salami, bacon, and ham are often laden with additives and ingredients that may not be prostate-friendly. Processed meats frequently contain nitrates and preservatives, such as sodium nitrite and sodium nitrate. These additives are used to extend the shelf life of the products and enhance their color and flavor. However, when consumed, nitrates can convert into nitrosamines, which are potentially carcinogenic compounds. Nitrosamines have been associated with an increased risk of various cancers, including prostate cancer. Processed meats are rich in saturated fats, which can lead to inflammation throughout the body, including the prostate gland. Inflammation is a key factor in prostate enlargement and can worsen related symptoms. Processed meats may also contain hormones and antibiotics that were administered to the animals during their growth. When we consume these meats, we introduce these hormones into our bodies, potentially disrupting our hormonal balance. Hormonal imbalance, including elevated estrogen levels, can contribute to prostate enlargement. Processed meats tend to be high in sodium, which can lead to increased water retention and potentially worsen urinary symptoms associated with an enlarged prostate, such as frequent urination and urgency. Consider reducing your intake of processed meats. Instead, opt for leaner sources of protein like poultry, fish, and plant-based alternatives like beans and tofu. Now, let's address a common beverage choice that can impact your overall health, including prostate health. Alcohol consumption can have far-reaching effects on your body, including your liver, hormones, and ultimately, your prostate. Alcohol is metabolized by your liver, which is responsible for detoxifying the body and maintaining hormonal balance. Over time, excessive alcohol consumption can damage liver cells and compromise the liver's ability to function optimally. Your liver plays a critical role in removing toxins from your body and regulating hormone levels. When your liver is impaired due to alcohol-induced damage, it may struggle to process hormones effectively. Hormonal imbalances, particularly elevated levels of insulin and estrogen, can result from liver dysfunction. This imbalance can lead to various health issues, including prostate enlargement. Elevated levels of insulin and estrogen have been linked to prostate enlargement. Insulin resistance, often caused by excessive alcohol consumption, can contribute to hormonal imbalances that promote the growth of prostate cells. Nettle leaf tea prostate-friendly alternative is caffeine-free and has anti-inflammatory properties. It's known for its potential to help alleviate urinary symptoms associated with an enlarged prostate. When we indulge in these sugary and starchy foods, our body swiftly converts them into sugar and glucose. As these foods break down, they cause a rapid surge in blood sugar levels. This sudden spike can have detrimental effects on our cells, especially when consumed in large quantities. In response to the surge in blood sugar, our body releases insulin, a hormone produced by the pancreas. The primary job of insulin is to shuttle sugar from the bloodstream into our cells, where it's used for energy production. Here's the catch. When we regularly consume excessive refined carbs and sugar, it leads to a continuous increase in blood sugar levels. 
As a result, the pancreas has to work overtime, producing more insulin to manage the excess sugar. Insulin is an anabolic hormone, which means it promotes cell growth and division. When there's an excess of insulin circulating in the body due to frequent sugar spikes, it can contribute to hormonal imbalances and disrupt the delicate equilibrium within the prostate gland. This hormonal imbalance, particularly the elevated insulin levels, has been associated with prostate enlargement. Insulin's role in promoting cell growth can affect the prostate gland, potentially leading to its enlargement. Opt for a balanced diet that includes whole grains, lean proteins, fruits, and vegetables. This dietary shift can help stabilize blood sugar levels, reduce inflammation, and maintain hormonal balance. And there you have it, folks, a comprehensive guide to the foods you should steer clear of if you're dealing with an enlarged prostate. If you found this video informative and helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more valuable insights on health and wellness. Thank you for tuning in and take care of your health. Until next time, stay well and stay informed.